We're here in Huntington Beach for the 2012 OMSE Rally, Rally Cross Launch Event. We have Tanner Faust, David Binks, Marcus Gromhol, and Brian Deegan. Let's go talk to them. I'm here with David Binks, Rallycross driver for the American Express Best Buy Fiesta. Hi, how are we doing? David, why don't you tell us about the car? What are you driving? Yeah, this year we're in the surf from American Express uh, OMSE Ford Fiesta. It's a 2012 model, four-wheel drive, global rallycross car. Absolutely amazing thing to drive. So, so what do you see for this year coming forward? Yeah, I mean, you know, we're very fortunate to be in the U.S. this year. Um, you know, I'm with one of the best teams in Global Rallycross, there's no doubt about it. Driving good old Ford, and uh, I would say probably the best car out there. Uh, it's going to be hard, we've got five identical cars, five very fast drivers. Um, you know, we're working hard to get that top step of the podium, and, uh, you know, we're pushing every race. Uh, Pre-season testing went well last week, and uh, we're quietly confident we're going to be up there. And you know, Global Rallycross is going from strength to strength. And uh, I see this being a good year for Ford, good year for us drivers out there, and hopefully, Surf for American Express is going to be on the top step of the podium. David, why don't you tell us what's the difference between your rally car and a stock Fiesta? Well, not a lot. I wish. Uh, no, no. This car is built from the production model shell. Uh, straight out of the factory, we take that shell, uh, or the team does, and uh, they scratch build from that shell. So, uh, I think it's about a thousand, two thousand hours goes into making the roll cage, um, the engine tunnel. That's all built around, and then all the other components get bolted on there. So we've got a two-liter uh, turbocharged engine. It's based off a standard block. There's a lot of work, a little tricky bits goes in there. But this car's putting out about 560 horsepower and 700 foot-pound of torque at the wheels. You know, 900 at the flywheel. This car is fantastic. We've got a torque band that just keeps on going all the way up and up and up. So as I'm shifting those gears, this car just keeps on pulling. Um, then you've got all the four-wheel drive train. Uh, you know, so no matter where we are, whether we're on dirt, in the air, taking those corners, this car just wants to go, go, go. So, you know, what's the difference? Apart from the wide arches, um, a bit more power in the four-wheel drive, you know, everything's based around that car. The development's done for the Ford car. Um, as you'll see, door handles, interior, apart from the, the road-going interiors taken out, you know, every part of your road-going Fiesta is sort of mimicked by this car. And uh, the de development we're doing now on this car can eventually end up in the production car. So it's you know, one, one plays off each other, and uh, the more work we do developing this car, the more it's going to end up in the road car. Very nice. Thank you. Cool, man. I'm here with Marcus Gromhol. Marcus, you want to tell us about your car here? Four-wheel drive, Fiesta, a lot of power, uh -huh. and uh, yeah, it's uh, start to be really, really good technically for me. A uh, few years ago, the rallycross cars were not that uh, high level uh, technically, but now, now it's really easy car to drive and uh, and the power is uh, really Great. something like. Can you tell us about yesterday? You were in Willow Springs testing out the car. What are you working on trying to accomplish for the test drive? Yeah, the main goal for the test was to shake down the car. It's a new, new one, my car. And we have new things in the engine, differential, and small things here and there. So there is a good improvement from last year. Of course, it was also a good uh, opportunity to, to 
drive the car because I haven't done uh, much with the car. So. Can you tell us about the, uh, the upcoming races? Which race are you looking forward to the most? Oh. Of course, X Games is a big, uh, big uh, race, but um, I think all, all these uh, global rallycross races are, are nice because they are now together with NASCAR. Yeah. I don't know how the track will be. I heard there is not much dirt, which I miss because I, I, uh, I like it when it's dirt part, but um, hopefully the track will be interesting. Okay, well, thanks a lot for talking Thank with us. Thank you. Appreciate it.